Paraphrasing, how to use others' ideas in your writing. In college, professors ask us to explore our field of study and topics of interest by reading and researching, going out on the internet, watching online presentations and lectures, going to libraries, and more. You will start to read about some great ideas, and you'll make connections between the ideas of other authors and your own ideas. So when your instructor assigns that five-page paper, you think you know exactly what you're going to write about. And you grab those great ideas and put them right into your paper. You don't want to change them around too much because it would be hard to say it better than the authors themselves. But when you get your paper back, your instructor said you had a similarity index of 88% and she gave you a zero on your assignment. Oh no! Now what do I do? Let's work on finding your own writing voice by learning how to paraphrase. Paraphrasing is using your own words to present the ideas of others while still giving credit to the original author. Paraphrasing helps you put their ideas into your own words and voice. Let's take a look at paraphrasing in action. Say you just finished reading a book and you really liked this quote. Mistakes are a part of being human. Appreciate your mistakes for what they are. Precious life lessons that can only be learned the hard way. Now you want to tell a friend about the book you read. I read this great book that said it's okay to make mistakes. Everyone makes them. They're just part of the learning process. Hey, this is perfect for my paper on child development. Let's see how to use the idea in your paper. In the same way you tell your friend about this idea, you Tell the idea to your reader when you write. Remember the original quote? Here is your paraphrasing of that quote. Making a mistake is part of being human, and some of our most important lessons are based on mistakes. And don't forget to put in the citation. Now you're ready to write your paper. Use paraphrasing to inform and support your own ideas. Here is your paraphrase. And now, here's your own idea. In childcare, it helps to know that mistakes are a natural part of learning. This is how it might look in your paper. Making a mistake is part of being human, and some of our most important lessons are based on mistakes. In childcare, it helps to know that mistakes are a natural part of learning. In summary, paraphrasing is helpful when you want to use another's idea to support your own ideas. You want to express another's idea but not use their exact words. You want to clarify an author's idea for the reader and for yourself. And finally, here are more resources to help you with paraphrasing and APA citations.